Windows 7 is one of the best designed operating systems in history. Today I'll tell you about seven reasons why it is at the top of the list of the best desktop systems ever, from my point of view. Number 1. Privacy In the year 2009, there were not many companies trying to steal your personal data, as is the case today. But today, social media business and advertising is based on your personal data and your browsing history. If you knew the amount of data that companies collect from your device, you would be shocked. Facebook, YouTube, TikTok, Instagram, and even Windows 10 and 11. And this is only a sample of the information that is collected. Your location, your name, the search box, your contacts, even keyboard presses, and the list goes on. And even if you disable the privacy settings while installing Windows, Microsoft has hidden ways to collect your data, and what is hidden is greater. Reason 2. Windows without Hocus Pocus When installing Windows 7, there are no programs or additions other than those necessary that you need, only the basic things. Let's take a look at the Start menu. There is nothing extra that is unnecessary, but when installing Windows 10 or 11, I spend half an hour or more adjusting the settings and deleting the bad additions. Unnecessary things like Spotify, Disney+, Skype, 5 of weather programs, 4 of photo browsers, 2 TV apps, 6 of music players, and more. Reason number 3. It is light on the device and does not consume many resources. This goes back to the previous point Windows without geeks. Just look at the device's resource consumption of less than 1 gigabyte of RAM, and the processor's consumption is literally 0%, because there are no applications other than those necessary for the system running in the background. But if we look at the other side, Windows 10 consumes 3 gigabyte of RAM, and processor usage in idle state impossible to go down to 0% as in Windows 7. Note only that each of the two systems I installed from scratch, that is, without brag, in addition to that I deleted any unnecessary applications from Windows 10. But despite this, Windows 7 is still superior. All operating systems increase their operating requirements from older versions to new ones. For example, Android 13 requires more than version 12, but it provides you with a better and faster usage experience, and you may be able to do things on it that you cannot do on Android 12. But on the other hand, Windows 10 does not provide, that is, because everything you can do on Windows 7 can be done on 10 and 11 because the root of the system is the same, only an increase in useless applications and more consumption of device resources. Reason number 4. Windows 7 is beautiful. Some may be surprised, but from my point of view, Windows 7 has the most beautiful and easy interface among all other systems. And I remember here when I saw the look of Windows 7 for the first time in 2009, I said to myself, wow, this thing came from the future and to this moment, and this is my personal opinion of Windows 7. It has the most beautiful appearance, from the transparent menus to the operating and navigation sounds and the basic themes. Everything is luxurious. Let's say that Windows 10 is attractive, and we agree on that, but it is not more than Windows 7. Reason number 5. Standard Interface. Go to Windows 7 and open any menu you want. You will find it consistent with the second with the same shape, appearance, and settings from the control panel to the user interface to the system interface. Everything is unified. Or for Windows 10 and 11, you will find a cocktail of onions with fruits. The new menus are not as strong and easy as the old ones, and this is due to the failed strategy, in my opinion, that Microsoft is following with regard to one system for the computer and the tablet. But it did not work in the best way, neither on the desktop nor even on the tablet. Microsoft, you should know that the desktop will remain a desktop, and the tablet will remain a tablet because the first has a touch interface, and the second is a keyboard and mouse, and the attempt to confuse them failed. On the other hand, Apple understood this matter a long time ago, as the Mac has its own system, the tablet has a different system, and the iPhone as well, but all these devices communicate wonderfully. Reason number 6. Stability. Now, we did not say that Windows 10 or 11 is unstable, but I used Windows 7 from 2009 to 2019, and I did not face any major problems with it. But with Windows 10, Problems began to appear with me since the first time I turned it on, and until now I still face problems with it from time to time. In three years I have had more problems with Windows 10 than I have had in 10 years with Windows 7. Reason number 7. Start Menu 
This, in my opinion and for many Windows users, which distinguishes it from any other operating system, to the extent that most modern systems have a similar start menu in one way or another, because it is practical and useful. It provides you with access to everything on the device with one click. Unfortunately, after Windows 7, the start menu level began to deteriorate with each new version, and don't let me start with Windows 8. To the point that Windows released an 8.1 update to solve this problem, but the damage had reached the bone, and Microsoft could not correct it, causing the system to fail. And it moves to Windows 10, so that Windows 8 and Vista become a black point in Microsoft's history. Leave us in the comments your opinion regarding Windows systems, which version do you prefer, and do you share the same opinion with us? Or do you have another view? I hope I haven't been too long. I'll see you in an upcoming video.